We'll guide you through how to download and install Sodium in Minecraft 1.21.7. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. Sodium will go and help optimize Minecraft and it gives you access to way more settings. To get started with this, we need to go and quit Minecraft. Next, you need to go and open up a web browser. What you can do is go and type in modrinth. Modrinth is the place where we can get different Minecraft mods from, so we can come to it. Then what we need to do is we can go and press discover mods and at the top press search. You can type in sodium or you may be able to go and see it here. What you can then do is go and press versions at the top. We can go and see some different versions here. We're looking for fabric for 1.21.7. Here it is. So we can come to the right and press download and it now has. Now what we need to do is go and get fabric because sodium requires fabric to go and run. So we can go and press back. And what we need to do is then go and search for fabric Minecraft like so. We can then come to the site fabricmc.net. Here we can then go and press download like so and press download for Windows. You can always get the universal jar if you want, but I find the word installer much easier to go and use. And then what we can do is go and press fabric API. And from here, you can go and press files and make sure we get it for 1.21.7. Press the three dots to the right and press download file and wait. Now it's important to note, you can go and get other mods. Just make sure they're for fabric and for 1.21.7. So we've now downloaded what we need, but before we start the install process, a big shout out to the sponsor of this video, Apex Hosting. If you're in need of a Minecraft server, go and check them out, link down below in the pinned comment and the description. Apex has got so many great features, for example, instant setup. So upon purchase, your server is gonna be ready to play in seconds. One click install mod packs, you can easily start modding it. DDoS protection, 24 seven servers and support, so you can get help anytime you need it for your always online server. Ultra latency, a powerful panel, and so much more. That's it. If you need to serve it, check them out down below. Now let's start the install process. So open up your file explorer and come to your downloads. You need to go and find the fabric installer and go and run it like so. Make sure you select 1.21.7 and press install. We've successfully installed it. Come down to the bottom and press search and you can then go and type in Minecraft Launcher and run it. Go to the top and you can press installations. Now go and scroll down and you want to go and find Fabric Loader 1.21.7 and press the folder icon to the right. This will bring you here. Go and scroll down and you need to go and find the folder called mods. Come into it. And then what we need to do is we need to go and add in sodium. So we'll come back to our downloads here and we can go and drag it in and we'll drag in the API as well and we've now gone and added it. We can then go and close it like this. Go and hover over Fabric Loader and press play to the right. And now it's going to go and start. Here we are. So what we can do is we can go and get into a world. Now, if we go and pause it by pressing escape and press options and video settings, you'll notice things look different. And this is because we're using Sodium. So hopefully you're now gonna get a better experience on Minecraft. If you found this useful and want to see more guides like this, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. And remember, if you need yourself a Minecraft server, make sure you go and check out Apex. A big thanks to them for sponsoring this video. If you need help with more Minecraft guides, check out the channel. We already have a ton there. And if there's anything you want to go and see, then feel free to leave a comment 